The U.S. Senate opposes sanctions on F-35 fighter jets to Turkey. Why? The U.S. Senate passed a defense spending bill recently that sought to prevent Turkey from getting the 100 F-35 stealth jets it ordered. Turkey's decision to purchase the Russian S-400S, it has already committed to delivery of the weapons, would result in consequences for the F-35 deal. In a July letter to Senate Appropriations Committee Chairman Richard Shelby, the White House's Office of Management and Budget Director, Mick Mulvaney, argued that Turkey is an important NATO ally and has been an international participant with the F-35 program since 2002. The S-400, one of the most advanced missile defense platforms around, is meant to engage and shoot down U.S. jets like the F-35, that rely on stealth. Retired U.S. Air Force Lieutenant General David Deptula told Business Insider that NATO countries don't want to be networking U.S. F-35 into Russian air defenses systems as it could lead to technology transfer and possible compromises of F-35 advantages to the S-400. If Turkey owned the F-35 and the S-400, it would give Russia a window into NATO's missile defense network and the F-35S next-generation capabilities. So for now, it seems selling the F-35 to Turkey is out of the question. So Turkish aerospace industries chose the Dassault and B system to accelerate the development of the TFX fifth-generation aircraft the newest and largest aviation development project in Turkey. For three experience platform to develop its next generation, multi-rail aircraft from design through production. Turkish Aerospace First delivery to TFX fifth generation fighter is planned for 2029 and will continue until 2039. Turkey's need for the TFX fighter jet would be 100 to 150 aircraft. According to Turkish Aerospace, the TFX fifth generation fighter jet will be a single seat multi role aircraft mainly designed for air to air role with a consideration for air to surface capability as well. It will feature stealth and super cruise capabilities, as well as new generation avionics. Turkish Aerospace and B Systems signed an agreement on January 2017 for the TFX engines Eurojet with an improved version of the EJ200 engine. Upon engineering analysis, preliminary studies based on information received from engines manufacturers, the TFX would have a twin engine configuration. Another option for Turkey Russia's Su-57 stealth fighter jet. If they bought the Su-57S and the S-400, those steps are incompatible with them buying the F-35. It's going to be either F-35 or S-400, said Dapchula, and given the track record of Russian advanced aircraft, not a good choice for Turkey. So Turkey getting S-400 would for military and diplomatic reasons, present a nightmare scenario for NATO's security. The U.S. Senate Committee has said that the transfer of the F-35S should not occur until the Secretary of State certifies to the appropriate congressional committees that the government of Turkey is not purchasing the S-400 missile defense system from Russia. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe.